A lot of things we hit on when we're doing our Firearms Fridays is ammunition economy. Like the 22, uh, CO2 air guns, but wouldn't it be something if, if we could shoot in the, the living room? <laughs> Hey, slow down, Elvis. Hey, Elvis used a real gun. It's a 357 Magnum, as I recall. But this week, David the Marine. Let me see your war face. You got a war face? And you've been hearing a lot about it from Sean Hannity and others. The Mantis X device. The Mantis X device is a laser that goes on to most semi-automatic guns, just like that. You turn it on, and it primes with an app so you can dry fire and practice your dry firing, plus it'll track your dry firing. Once you get it turned on, you fire up the app, and then the devices have to pair but it has its own shot timer and it has a number of different exercises to go through. So we're just gonna start with the basic one. The disadvantage with dry fire is that you have to rack the slide after each shot. As an instructor, David, what do you think? Uh, you need more lessons. Are you ready? Sure. Stand by. All right, all in the bullseye. But that's also having to rack the slide each time, which that messes up. If you've already got a good dead on uh, target, it messes that up. So let's try it with live rounds now. So better, better. And then it has all kinds of little displays to show you what you're doing with the gun. Ninety-five-three. So yeah, when you're at your house, dry firing, television, maybe backyard, whatever it may be, it will at least give you some direction. But the having to rack the slide each time to me is what, because you saw I, I did better when I didn't have to rack the slide, which is going to be in a real life situation. But let's hear what a grandmaster thinks. Lower your expectations. Uh, this is uh, unique. Um, Sean Hannity claims to score 100% on this all the time. No, there, there's no way you score 100% on this. Um, it has its, its uses. It won't fit into a holster, so you can't, no. can't practice your draw. Uh, the I do like the feedback, but what we did do, I wanted to see if it was possible to get 100. And we rested the gun and pulled the trigger ever so slightly. It would never be that still in real life. And it still missed the bullseye and scored less than 100. So if you can reconcile that with yourself that you can't score 100, uh, high 80s, low 90s, you'll be, okay, that's going to be probably the best you can do with this thing. If it gets you with your gun and your, your dry firing and you're practicing, that is all good, you know, going towards the goal of being able to hit your target on demand. Uh, but for me, hang on, hang on. Bottom line, David, where are you going? Hey! As always, guns, guns for everybody. everybody.